Hello, in this video we are going to talk about sheet custom properties in the Sheet Set Manager in AutoCAD. More specifically, sheet custom properties and the non-breaking space. This will apply to Sheet Set custom properties too. So I'm going to use a data set that's in my Autodesk University 2019 folder, Exercise 3. I'm going to open up a Sheet Set. I'm going to right click and I'm just going to look at the properties. And you can see I have some project control data in here, which just says value, which is default and then project data in here. But we want to enter custom data. So we're going to double click our sheet. This is basically our title block that we're going to use to edit. And you'll see down here, the default properties are just set to value right now. But what we're going to do is add some sheet custom properties. So right click, hit properties. These are attached. We're going to edit. Let's delete what Autodesk has provided because we're going to use our own for our custom and hit OK. So the first thing we want to do is add sheet custom properties, properties that are controlled by the layout, the layout or the sheet, each individual sheet drawn by, checked by. Not everybody does every single drawing in the package. Add a custom properties, add sheet custom properties, the name 01 drawn by, and then you could do the colon. Now I could leave it at value and it would show up value. If I put a blank here, you're going to get four dash lines like this. I can use percent percent U which would, would be a blank space, but I'm going to use the non-breaking space. So on my keyboard, I'm going to hold down the Alt key and hit 0160. And you see how it danced a little bit, jumped in there, add 02 check by. And then the, the non-breaking space, Alt 0160. Hit OK. Hit OK. And you can see when I touch them, see how it's kind of like shows a blank field, but up here there's nothing. That's how you know the difference. We're going to regen. We're going to go back down here and add these to show you what it looks like. Go under, we're under drawn by, and we're going to hit current sheet custom, drawn by. Drawn by. You see how it's blank? And then we'll go check by. Hit OK and OK and you've entered your non-breaking space. So that's how you do that in Autodesk AutoCAD.